manifold is the heart of your radiant floor heating system, and it distributes warm water throughout your floor heating pipe loops to heat your rooms. Here's a basic look at the water pathway around your manifold. Your manifold needs to be connected to your heat source with both a flow and a return pipe. The pump in the manifold circulates the warm water supplied from your heat source through the flow pipe into the manifold. The warm water is then circulated through the top flow bar and down the pipe loops to heat your floor. The water then returns to the manifold into the bottom return bar, where it either returns to the boiler for heating via the boiler return valve, or it's recycled back into circulation. Let's take a closer look at how the manifold works. When the warm water reaches the manifold, it passes through the thermostatic blend valve. This blending valve mixes the warm water supplied from your heat source with the ambient temperature water already inside the manifold. The probe connected to the thermostatic blend valve measures the temperature of the water inside the manifold flow bar. Once the required temperature is reached, the probe signals the blend valve to stop letting warm water into the system. This protects your floors from being damaged by overheating. The only direction the water can travel is up through the pump into the top manifold flow bar. Here the thermometer will give you an accurate reading of the water temperature going into your floor loops. Each pipe loop is regulated via a flow gauge. These flow gauges restrict or increase the flow of water going into each pipe loop. These are adjusted depending on the length of each individual pipe loop so that you have a balanced flow of water throughout your system. Water returns to the manifold from the floor loops into the bottom return bar. The thermometer on this bar will give you an accurate reading of the water returning to your manifold. This is generally some 10 degrees less due to the heat being transferred from the pipes and radiated into your rooms. The water now flows one of two ways. If the thermostatic blend valve is letting warm water into the system, then cooler water needs to be released from the manifold to make room for the warm water. The cooled water will then exit through the boiler return valve and back to the boiler for reheating. If the blend valve isn't letting warm water into the system, then the pump pressure will cause the one-way valve in the bottom pump elbow to open. This allows the water already in the system to recirculate through the pipe loops. Our manifolds are available in two ports, all the way up to 12 ports. They can be used with 16, 15 and 12 mm pipe. They're simple to install and come with a lifetime guarantee.